Hello, today we're going to show you how you can sign up for the custom domain name on Outlook.com. You remember you used to get a free email address via Google, Gmail, but now Gmail have a policy of asking you $10 for every new account you may want to get via them. So it's a nice substitute to go for Outlook.com. All you need to do is go on domains.live.com, click on get started, enter the domain address, set up outlook.com for my domain, continue, sign in with existing or create a new account in your domain example, person at blah blah blah. So remember you have to sign in if you don't have an existing account of fairview.net. Uh, since you're signing up for an email service, I believe you, don't, you should not have it. So you should already have uh, an existing Microsoft account. So click on that, continue. So they're asking you to sign in that particular account of yours. So once I'm here, it's asking me that uh, it's asking me to review everything which I entered. Domain is this, mail service is this, administrator is me uh, with my old email address. And clicking that accept means that you agree with the terms. If you are too good uh, with reading and everything, just click on that and read every all, all the terms of service, which people normally doesn't do, and click on I accept. So once you click on I accept, it's asking you to verify the ownership of the domain, which uh, since I purchased my domain via moniker.com, so I'll just do that. So here I logged into my uh, moniker account from where I purchased this domain. Uh, I'm going to click on zone records over here, and then I'm going to click on my domain name. Voila. So I'll just add the information over here. So I just added this MS MX record, and now I'm clicking refresh here. So now my uh, my domain address, domain name is verified. Turkey.net. Where the settings which I did, I did was I added a text record instead of MX record because uh, somehow Hotmail was never able to verify because of MX record. So I added the TXT record over here. And now you can see it's loading and loading, and I'll keep you updated how to go forward with it. So as you can see, the account is made. I can add up to like, I can create new accounts, and that's it. So this is how you do it, people. Just get yourself a free account of Outlook.com with your custom domain. So all the best.